Okay, guys, welcome. Whoops, a doodle. Sorry about that. Welcome back to, uh, well, welcome back to Farming Simulator with myself, Mr. Al. Uh, at the minute, I'm in a new map, which is called Hagenstad, which was from um, Farming Simulator 2013. Now, so far, I've racked up a nice few euro. Um, and this is the farm as it is at the minute. Uh, I've done a little bit of harvesting, I've done a few other bits, bit of rowing, bit of seeding. Just gonna jump into my transit here and I'll show you what I mean. There's uh, two fields, 15 and 16, which you'll see there on the map. Just to the left of the map, you'll see it. And I have merged both of them fields, excuse me, into one. Now, as you can see, it's getting very foggy actually. <sighs> Sorry, a bit out of breath, I was running ish. <laughs> 15 and 16 would have been separated here. And this would have been a walkway across between those two trees there. So um, I've merged the two of them into one long field and I have wheat uh, sown there. And the far side I have literally just harvested. I've just gone over some work there. Uh, some corn. But obviously the choppers and the machine is in the way so I better just move it real quick. Um, Better just chop this last little bit and... Fold it all up and let that guy go back to what he was doing. Which was uh, ploughing... Uh, the field, getting it ready for the next yield. So, it's not too bad. It's, it's getting there, it's slowly but surely. I'm a bit of a knee freak, bit of OCD when it comes to this game. I like to have everything matching, so I always like to get rid of all the dirty bits, you know? The bits that weren't supposed to be uh, left out, we'll say. So I'll just drop that plow there and let this man here continue his job. And I'm going to fly on over here and get this combine back to base. Oh, God. Okay, the van work. <laughs> the van's in better order. So, I'm just gonna put the pipe out over the uh, seeding trough or seeding, whatever. The collector. Oh, there's another big piece here that I missed. So it'd be good to get this in before he gets down. Before he plows it, it's an extra bit of crop for us. And where are we are lower. Uh, turn on. Get all that in there, just. Just adds to a little bit more yield for the storage facility that we have. Hackettstad is great, it's probably one of the best maps because the shop is so close to the, uh, the farm. Now the shop is just down the road behind me, around a small bend, and it's there pretty much in front of you. Uh, I'll give you a map tour now in a little bit. I've installed a ramp here for loading of high-sided vehicles. Uh, I haven't had to do it yet, but I will have to load something soon. Uh, let's drop that pipe out there real quick. There we go. Just unload that there. Knock off the lights, get into a van. And head back to the yard and get a uh, cedar onto this as quick as we can. Now, 14 is quite a large field. We get a lot of yield from the crop uh, in this field if it's fertilized. So, I'm going to go run a sprayer over it right now. And then I'll get a. Um, what do you call it? I'll get a. La -la 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 -la. <laughs> a cedar over it. This sprayer right here is a 40 meter uh, span, so it's quite large. Oops. Put that back. You get most of the field done with the sprayer. It's just to fertilize it, and then when I seed it again with that seeder, the Amazon seeder, I'll uh, re it'll re um, fertilize it as well. I don't know what's going on with this weather lately. It's so bad in this game. It's foggy, it's misty, it's weird. 
this is quite a wide seater. This is a new mod I downloaded recently. And it's my second time using it. And to be honest, I'm very impressed with it because there's a lot it can do. It takes a good capacity of about four, 5,000 litres of uh, fer liquid fertiliser. So it's a, it's a good that's a good machine. It's good to have on the farm. So I'll just set a worker on that. Make sure he's getting the area. He's supposed to. Yeah, he's doing fine. Very uneven field, though. So, i got to cultivate it, sorry, and then I'll seed it. i cultivate that fertilizer in, and then I'll seed it again with this, which also uh, contains uh, fertilizer. The white is the fertilizer, and the brown color is the seeds. So anyway, for the minute, I'm going to just let that guy do his job there. Actually, as a matter of fact, he's covered so much distance. I think I'd be alright. I'd be good enough. Um, uh, whatever the word is. Cultivating this now. Now, it'll go a different colour when it's cultivated, but it'll, it'll still remain... Uh, good, the field is still being good, uh, sold of health, we'll say. So, I let this fella run up here with this. We'll let him get about four runs up and down, and then we'll get the cedar on it behind him. That way, we're getting three uh, machines working at once, which I think is very uh, effective when it comes to farming because it, it, it's good to have it in proper order getting it all working together because it reduces time reduces sitting around and getting bored of the game if you can do it all at once you can get a lot more work done this guy's nearly done okay he's got one more run down and another he's got another two runs which way is he going with this I'm gonna has he gone down here already I don't know where he's gone on the right track there. I don't know where he's gone with this. He doesn't seem to want to um, do it. It's definitely meeting, right? No, I won't do it. I'd better do this myself. He doesn't seem to want to um, do it alone for some reason. I don't know what's going on. I don't know, is the fog freaking him out or something, or the bumps in the field? Bit of first person view here inside. It's giving us an idea here on the screen on the left there, what the field is, where it is and all the rest. Good detail inside, well finished, clear, descriptive detail of the uh, tools inside the machine. Good heads up display. Controls are quite legit as well, and the obviously your information panel about your fuel and so on and so forth. We're getting there very slowly. This guy is coming up quick on the um, with the seed or with the cultivator anyway. Better just get this guy out of the way over here. I don't know why he stopped there. A lot of workers in this game don't seem to like doing, don't seem to like completing the fields for some reason. I don't know why or what their understanding of it is, but if they don't want to do it, they don't want to do it, I'll not pay them. I run right back over here and get that last row done and that'll be the harvesting or the what do you call it whatever this is called spraying done that'll be the spraying completed then as soon as I run up here once more they won't do it they just don't want to do the work for some reason so I gotta do it
Right, so we've cleared the weather. Uh, we're a significant time difference. We're gonna hire a worker and get this, uh, get this sewn. And then we'll run over it again after with a sprayer. The fertilizer in this thing, I don't really see, makes much of a difference as opposed to the other side of the field there. You can see it sprayed. That's pretty much what I'm at here. This guy's nearly done. Two more passes, I say, should cover that there, or thereabouts anyway. Uh, I got a what is that teleporter in here? Digger and plow, tractor and plow. Um, it's not really much else to do because I haven't bought any other um, machinery, you know. This is another field of corn I could harvest, which. I don't know where it is though. We could check on the map though, of course, or on our main menu and see which field has which. Now, field 27 has corn, field 13 has corn. Where's that canola? Where's corn? Oh, what the heck? Corn's a different colour in this game. Right. Um. Ooh, field 2, I think, is corn. Or is that spuds? It's hard to know, to be honest, what field has what. Uh, it's up beside field one. Field one is a hell of a lot of product in that. I think it's wheat. Field one is wheat. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go and drive up to field one. And buy it. And harvest it. Because there'll be a lot of wheat there. There'll be a lot of bales made. And I can sell a lot of straw. Better just dump this header off in here real quick. Keep it in under the covers of the weather. Chicken's gone mad at me. It's got to go pick up this 34 header. Head up to field one and see how we get on. It should be okay. I'll show you a bit of the map in here. We're heading up here rather than just skipping through it. So the old beacon's on safety first. But um, yeah, it's, just, it's a nice map. It's a map I remember from 2013. It was the best uh, map that I thought was on the game. I'll be honest with you, it really was. I thought it was a fantastic map at the time. And when I had a laptop that played games, I actually modded this map like there was no tomorrow. And it's so many cool machines and trucks and diggers and all sorts of cool stuff on it. But back then, uh, I didn't really have much interest in YouTube or putting anything up. So that's pretty much why I haven't done anything. But nowadays, I can't even afford a laptop where you can play games on it, so I'll just use the Xbox, which I'm on now. I'll just mess around doing this. I hope you guys enjoy the videos. Because uh, a bit of work goes into making them. It's not just sit there, record a game, and edit it. Like, you have to get it right, you know? <clears throat> field 4 is also massive as well. That'd be a good field to do next if it worked, and also I have storage right beside it. Ooh, field 4 would be good, it's just a cornfield. Field 3 is huge. That looks like... I don't know what's in that field. I think it's not there for a sec. That... It's definitely... That's canola or barley, it's definitely not wheat anyway. What's in that? buy it anyway just to have just so your man can harvest it on me that's a massive field field tree is huge i'm not going to harvest it today though i'll do it maybe later on or tomorrow or i mean right now i meant sorry well field one is right up ahead of me just below the wind top of the windshield and that is huge field one is so big it's about three times as 
It's about four times the size of that field to my left. You're going to get some harvest from that. I'm going to really enjoy harvesting it. To the right, it looks like there's spuds in it. Potatoes. Okay, let's go and buy this field. It's going to cost me a million quid, I'd say. Minimum. It's going to be really interesting to see how, uh, how expensive this is. That's not even wheat, or it is wheat. Okay, 800,000 bucks. Or oh, we buy it. Because I'll make that back on uh, on the yield, probably. Alright, let's get set up. set this correctly. Bring it out all the way and down because she grabbed the most of it then. This is a big ass field. This is going to take a long time to, uh, to harvest. I might just buy a second harvester and start from the far side. business. Let's go buy another harvester. Buy another one of these. We select yes and we will buy another header. A long header. So we've got a 30 foot header. Sorry, 13 meter header. Sorry, I keep saying 30 feet. That's, that's incorrect. My apologies, folks. My apologies. Go to the shop. Bring this guy down. the shop anyway for anyone that needs to know where it is it's literally just around the corner from the farm which again I think is fantastic come on out of the way I might even harvest field four which is the one I was just to, which I one I bought a few minutes ago field one was the biggest one I bought but field 4 wouldn't be a bad idea if I harvested that either. See, so you're not getting swath from it. I want the straw. I'll just harvest it anyway. No, I'll go up to field 1. That guy's gonna need a dig out anyway. It's a huge field. Shouldn't be too bad. Man, out of the frickin' way, come on. Don't make it. Ain't good, not very responsible driving. Oh well, I'm bigger than all of them, I've right away. I don't really care, I just want to save a bit of time. That guy is driving quite slow. So I'm going to start this fella off down to the other side of the field. That way he might be able to meet up with this one somewhere around here in the middle. <clears throat> At some point in the uh, the map. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching the, the quick gameplay vlog. I'll, uh, thanks for hanging out with me, and I'll have another one up fairly shortly.